Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Um, and today's video is gonna be a self care night. So meaning we're gonna do like face masks. I'm, I'm about to curl my hair right now. I'm gonna show y'all like my hygiene routine, like just stuff like that. Just take like the whole night for myself because this week have been, it's it's also Wednesday. Um this week has been stressful with midterms and then ACTs tomorrow. Like it's been, it's just been a lot. Um I'm about to do my hair and like curl it. Um because I'm getting bored. Like I'm really getting bored of it. Like most of the time, if my hair is already like curled and I straighten it, that means I'm getting bored of it. But if my hair is already straightened and I'm curling it, that means I'm getting bored of it. Cause I already did a middle part. Now I'm back to a side part. And I was going to do layers for my middle part, but I feel like when I'm done with the hairstyle in general, I'm gonna put it back in the middle part and then I'm gonna cut layers in it. But right now, <laughs> this is real bad. Like, I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. I had on a hat for the past two days because uh, we was doing midterms and it was no point of me, like, looking cute and stuff in midterms. Like, I literally dressed like a bum for the past two days. You know what's time to take it out when you can barely see your part anymore. Like, I, I, like, I had to search for the part. Then I gotta make sure all my hair covered. Like, at this point, it's time to take it out. Come on me, keep all of your things, yeah. We can stop the Gucci, stop the Louis V, yeah. Come on me, fly you out to Greece, full speed, so pour it belly in. Yeah. Come on me, keep all of your things, yeah. We can stop the Gucci, stop the Louis V, yeah. Come on me, fly you out to Greece, full speed, so pour it belly that's if you gay, Bruce. Alright, so I'm gonna turn this off. It's off. Um, I am done my hair. Let me see. Curls. I think it's like one, two, three, four, five, six. It's like seven. This is the bit. Not too much. It feels like a mess. Not too much. Not too much. Um, yeah. I'm gonna curl my hair. I hope it'll turn out cute tomorrow. And I also have to find a, a nice outfit because I'm going to a basketball game. Um, I got ACTs tomorrow and I'm going to a basketball game. It's my school's, like, the boys' basketball. Um, I wanted to go to the girls' basketball game, but unfortunately I could not. It's my first high school experience. And, like, come on, like, I need to get all the experience that I can get, like, you know? Like, I need to just talk all out for it, you know? Um, anyways... Now what I'm about to do is, um, I have this little like shelf thingy thing on like in the corner of my room, like over there somewhere, and I'm gonna put like all my perfumes, lotions, body wash, hair care, skincare, whatever. I'm gonna like sit up on the shelf and stuff. All right, before I go over, I like um put the stuff up. Yo, please get this kind of old time, yo get it get please like ever since i tried the mingle guy life has felt different this is a little thing i was talking about and if you're wondering why i look a little dingy it's because it's upside down that part is supposed to be on top and i'm gonna tell you why okay so basically it was a spider in my room it was a spider in my room i think what Sunday, yeah, it was a spider in my room Sunday, and I was trying to get it. So I put my foot like on the on the top trust of y'all. See, I put my foot on there, and it broke. So like, if I when I lift it up, it's like it's like broke. So today my mom was like, um, um, today trash day. You might as well put it in the trash. If you don't need it no more. Like just put it in the trash. So I was about to, but then this one, when I was pushing it, um, and I had flipped it over. Like, it was already in the hallway. I flipped it over. I'm like, Mom, do you know I could have just flipped this over? Like, I only throw it in the trash. And she was like, okay, well, then don't throw it in the trash. So when I got home, I put it back into my room. So now I got to put everything back on there. Like, I got to put everything back on there. It's all my, oh, that's college stuff, like college mail. This is some of my, um, what's it called? Like, 
perfumes and body wash lotions. All my hair supplies were lotions and perfumes and then more lotions and perfumes and it filled the whole bin up. Alright. Basically, I'm going to sit right here and I'm put on this show. So, and yeah. If you could say, it's like this. I don't like when I do that. I'm done. Look at it. Okay, so since I'm already sitting down here, I'm going to put my books up. And look at all of this, yo. I literally, like, it fell. I tried to bring it down, but it all fell. No, so I'm going to put y'all back on the shoe. Okay. Whew. So, now I'm going to put all my books up since I'm already down here. My books are always going to last. I got this new book. I didn't read this yet. It don't really tell me what it's about. It just says... It says, um, Madeline Marston is definitely afraid of bugs, especially spiders. Theodore Barthmillo is petrified of dying. Lulu Punch Lower is scared of. Can't wait to read this. Anyways, I have a lot of books. Like, I'm gonna count how many books I have, and I'm gonna tell you how many books. I have a lot of freaking books. Anyways, let's go. The ones that I don't read, I'm gonna put in the back. And the ones that I do read, I'm gonna put in the front. Like, all these books, I think I at least read like twice. Let's get started. Now, this book, I got like three or four of the series and I have yet to read it so I don't think I am either it just it don't give me like it looks so dumb like I don't even know who gave me this I know I'm not gonna read this um I got this book a long 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 time ago I was had to be in like elementary school and you know the book fairs to have yeah yep yep got this a long time ago hunger games i got one two and three when i was homeschooled um in sixth grade we read this the hunger games and we read down if we could in seventh grade we read where's where's other hunger games in seventh grade we read this book in the outsiders and then eighth grade, we read this book and another book. I'm not too sure what the other book was. We, we read another book. But basically, all through middle school, I read all three of The Hunger Games. And I watched all four of the movies. It's all so good. Oh, oh no. And then we read... um. I have two. I don't know why I have two Mock and Jays. One of them are my bro is my brothers. One of them is this. I know. I know it is. And we also read this book, The Boy in the Shopping Shamans. This book is so sad. And then the movie is even sadder. Like, um, Dying with a Kid. I'm definitely going to read this again. When I get bored, I'm going to read this again. Um, this, I don't think I'm going to read this again. I mean, Judy the movie. That was cool. But I, I, I think if I read this again, I might have to be the boredest thing on earth. Sunny Side Up. This book is really good. Um, it's from the creator of this book. This book is really, really good. I will read this book. I know the book is really good. But um, basically, it's about this like, like. So I will read it again. I have this High School Musical book, and I also have this um True Jackson book. Those zit face this is a really good book it's about this girl um 
she wants to be an actress like and she did like a bunch of these commercials she i think she's like 13 14 i don't know she did a bunch of these like commercials she's basically a, a, um, an actress and um she finally hits puberty like she's been an actress since she was like at least like five or whatever but like she finally hits puberty and she gets this big pimple on her face right before her big um like movie or album commercial whatever but for her big um appearance and she got so scared she didn't want to go outside no more and then she finally got her first um boyfriend but he didn't like her no more rumors spread around her like it was just a lot of stuff going on with this book it's a very if i recommend this for like upcoming teenagers because i read this when i was an upcoming teenager and my mom got this book for me um when she was at the doctor's so i have not like read it all because it kind of lost me like i feel like because wait what what number is this this is the book 12 i feel like i need to start from the first one in order to know what's going on like i was just very lost so i start reading it i was homeschooled and i was supposed to be homeschooled this um school year but obviously i got into kip so i'm not homeschooled and they had sent my box in like the school i went to you don't have to like pay for anything like they send you everything they send you art supplies um math supplies english supplies like everything they literally send you every single thing like you do not need like anything okay, i'm just put diary for kid back there you can never go wrong with it if you don't have not one diary with the kid book what are you doing with your life like little trio they all buy the same um thing these two this is about sunny going to visit her grandpa in florida and it was kind of boring until she met a friend then made it all exciting this one is about um her and her family like throughout like throughout a year i think it was based in 1960 or something i don't know her brother got sent to military school because he was out of control um and yeah so it was just all about her life um this book right here is the first book i got um i think i got these from my sister i'm not too sure or i think we got it from like because we're in my old neighborhood they have these like little um like i don't, I don't want to say treehouse thingies but like they look like a mini house and they got books inside there so you take a book you put a book back and i think and i did that one day so yeah um yeah this book is good it's about this girl her name is rena um one day she was with her friends and she tripped and she tripped and fell running to the house and to her two front teeth went up so she had to get uh taken out then she had braces braces off again um she had two fake teeth at certain time she had to wear this bracket like it was just a lot going on for rena rena was really going through it oh this when i tell y'all this is some tea this book is some tea like this book literally makes you like um then we got a series of unfortunate events this is book number eight to kill a mockingbird this book yo this book is amazing it's amazing we got more series of unfortunate events book this is the third book this is this um seventh book and this is the eighth book see these i can read these like out of order because i understand all of it i already watched the movie and i watched the um the tv show 27 i have 27 books my fault i have another series of unfortunate events book under my bed and i have another book called temptation real nice book i love it i just realized that cl one clip was 18 minutes long. This is going to be a lot of fucking editing. Yeah. As I'm editing this video, I realized that I talk too much. So just listen to this um music. Hello, stranger. It's been a minute since we last kissed. By the way... Just got in town, and I won't let cumulus clouds all in the sky ruin my vibe. And usually, I don't do this often, but since recruiting isn't an option, due to unusual. 
I think they great at midterms, but I'm seeing all my grades right now. Just listen, I'm tired. I'm gonna have to watch that. It is 546. I think I'm gonna chill for a while. So I just put the face mask on. I should have recorded me doing it because, like, first of all, I put it on so unevenly. Like, but whenever I put face mask on my forehead, that's when all these pimples are popping up. I'm like, what? So like, I never put like I'm never I never I'm never gonna put a face mask on my forehead ever again. This is a combo that y'all need. This though, you gotta put this plus this works wonders you see i barely got any more left i need to go get some more So this video is over. I took the face mask off. My face look a little clear. I look a little good. Make sure you like, comment, and share with a friend and subscribe. Like just subscribe. Like you don't even gotta do much. Just like subscribe. Um make sure you follow my Instagram, TikTok, Twitter. Yeah, make sure y'all just make sure y'all follow those because I'm very really, like active on those too. Like I, well, except for Twitter. Literally, my bio is I tweet when I'm bored. So I don't know, but you, yeah. well, have a good night.